Hello, thanks for checking in. I'm reading from my online journal called Wandering Wilbo, and I have an item that I wrote two years ago in February of 2015. My daughter grew to love sushi. So two years ago, on a day cold enough to be annoying, I treated her to Sadako, a sushi restaurant in Ann Arbor. Sadako honors a young woman of Japan who suffered radiation sickness after surviving the atomic blast at Hiroshima. Her name was Sadako and she folded 1300 origami paper cranes before succumbing to leukemia. She believed in a Japanese myth that she would be granted power to change the world. She is honored by a statue in Hiroshima. Daily, hundreds of paper cranes are offered at the base. That said, I read Friday that a great flock of Zand Hill cranes had been reported resting on its northern migration near Mammoth Cave, Kentucky. I hope the sucker punch of a late winter polar surge doesn't cause illness and weakness to lessen the flock. My thoughts are migratory from Japan to Kentucky and to Ann Arbor as I await my Sadako. She has added five minutes onto my wait and yet I wait for her as expectantly as I await the arrival of Sandhill Cranes to Jackson County, Michigan, and to Jasper County, Indiana.